Hey, welcome to another video by DJSBRC, Project Cherokee. And I want to take a couple of seconds before we dive in in the, the booklet here. Uh, I want to say this video is brought to you by Great Hobbies. Don't forget to check out their website, www.greathobbies.com. The link will be in the description below. On the last video, basically I showed you guys uh, the links and the direction link, should I say, uh, for the steering and the upper and lower link. Now, that was step basically 11 and down. Now we're at the step 13, 12 and 13. What I did in advance, I pre-built the links, not to bore you guys with more link video to do. If you were able to do these guys here, you should be able to do these here. Now, there's one thing I wanted to mention. There's a set, they're, they're straight. They're both identical. But there's the other one on step 13. You have to make sure your links are different sizes and different shapes and different direction. Just make sure to note the direction of these links here. Okay? If you follow your book, it will tell you exactly. Let's grab a rear diff. Pointing this direction here. The two straight ones. One goes here, one goes there. And again, sometimes these plastic are a little bit hard to put in your screws in. Or your link, should I say. To make this easier on me. Instead of having to bore you guys looking at me screwing screw down and I do apologize if the drill makes a lot of noises let's pop this guy in and like I said sometimes they are a pain to do Now you don't want to over tighten these guys too. And like you see, they're all loose. When you grab the upper links, there is a direction they go. They need to be this way in the physical uh, link or the diff. And these guys here need to point up like a physical hook. Uh, okay. Thought I was doing a, a boo boo here. You pop them in the diff housing, and you'll see these guys point up. I grab a driver to make sure everything's aligned, driver goes on both sides. Then I grab my screw. Everything still moves, wobbles, gobbles. And this is attaching your rear links on your rear diff. If you guys have any questions or comment, post them below. I'll be gladly to answer you guys. If you like this video, don't forget to hit that uh, notification, the like thumbs up, should I say? <laughs> and <laughs> if you want to be notified next time I upload a video, don't forget to hit that bell notification and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching, guys.